Well, I've never been to a cop bar before. Yeah, and look at the bartender. I bet working here, she's one of those women who's tough as nails and good at giving sass. What'll it be, fellas? I'd like to cram both your boobs into a martini glass. <laughs> I, I, I think she's just a normal woman. To Joe Swanson and the biggest drug bust in the history of Quahog. Hey! Officer Swanson, I just wanted to say congratulations. I'm Nora. I just joined the force. Nice to meet you. Wow, I've heard so much about you. You're like a legend at the Academy. Is it true you got straight A's in Officer Henderson's over-intensity workshop? You're damn right I did! Well, you did some great work today. And I mean regular person great, not just wheelchair person great. Yeah, I guess. You seem a little distracted. Is everything okay? Uh, yeah, sorry. I was just thinking about that. So someone should have come tonight, but they didn't. That's nothing. That's good. Hey, Officer Swanson? Yeah. You know how they say never meet your heroes? Well, they don't say anything about kissing them. Whoa! Jeez, every cop in town is here. I know. Who do you think's taking care of the city? No. 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 What the hell? Come on! No drive. He's wet. <laughs> Hey, fun party last night, Joe. You guys, I got something to tell you. The weirdest thing happened to me at that party. I got kissed by this chick cop. No way! What's she look like? Is she hot? Well, I don't know. Uh, is Elizabeth Perkins hot? I... I, uh... I, I don't... I, I don't know. Way to go, Joe. Did you bang her? What? Of course not, Quagmire. I mean, I'm a married man. I could never cheat on Bonnie. Well, under normal circumstances, you'd be right to say that. But in this case, cheating would be the only fair thing. What? What are you talking about? Come on. Didn't Bonnie have that affair in Paris? Oh, yeah. I don't want to talk about that. Joe, how can I put this delicately? He used his stinky French wiener to defile her. Wow, that's a uh, real hit above the belt. But I'm still not sure that's a reason to betray Bonnie. Come on, Joe. Sleeping with this girl will even things up. You can't have that kind of imbalance in your relationship. In fact, you owe it to Bonnie to have sex with this woman. It's for the good of your marriage. Yeah, you should go for it, Joe. Secrets are what keep a marriage fresh. I have a CB radio in the basement. I go down there a couple times a week to have CB sex. Lois has no idea. Break a break of one nine. Watch your 20. <laughs> oh, it's so hot just knowing you're in a truck. Good morning, Officer Swanson. Oh, hey, Nora. Uh, listen, I... It's okay, Joe. You don't need to explain. I stepped over the line at the bar last night, and I'm sorry. It's not that I don't find you attractive. I do. I just... I'm married, and... I get it. I totally understand, Joe. Excuse me. Hello. Joe? Bonnie? Oh. I, I meant to call someone else. Oh. Yeah. So how is everything? <sighs> Didn't Bonnie have that affair in Paris? He used his stinky French wiener to defile her. Didn't Bonnie have that affair in Paris? He used his stinky French wiener to defile her. Hey, Quagmire, we're in Joe's head. Hey, let's mess with him. I'm gonna leave a fart trapped in here. <laughs> All right, let's get out of here. I want you. I want you too. Come on. I have a little place we can go to. Wow. I've never seen a sofa in a bathroom stall before. Well, I'm the only one who comes in here, so I figured I'd make it my own. How are you enjoying your steak? Mmm, it's delicious. Let me put another log on the fire. Thanks, Joe. It was getting a little chilly in here. Well, that's because you're all the way over there. Well, let me fix that. Mm. Oh, Joe. Oh, Nora. Did you bring protection? Oh, don't worry. Nothing comes out of the front. Giggity, giggity. Giggity, goo. Stick around.